Welcome back, everyone. Our next guest has three tasty ways to freshen up the flavor of your favorite summer meals. Nancy Waldeck is back. Thank goodness Yay. for me. Thank that means you. lunch on Nancy. Woohoo! We want to <laughs> dive right in. This looks so amazing. We're talking about cooking with fresh herbs today. You have a couple recipes, and we're getting started with something that's so simple, and that's just dressing. It is. It's a tarragon vinaigrette. So if you'll put those ingredients in, Christine. Yummy. So I've got a little olive oil. Okay. Some chopped tarragon. Yeah. Sure. Sure. Okay. Why not? Uh, okay. Man. Oh, wow. Ah. Oh, my goodness. This and is amazing. I know. White vinegar. Okay. We've got some garlic that we've already grated right in there. Perfect. And a little, pinch? not all, pinch. Yeah, pinch, yeah. <laughs> I was going to do that. it, I promise. <laughs> Yay. That would have been a lot, right? <laughs> okay, so this is how easy it is to make all your own salad dressing. Look at that. And that's it. That's it. Okay, so we took this salad dressing before we grilled off our beautiful veggies. Yes put the salad dressing on, tossed it, and grilled them off. And look, wouldn't you be excited to have that? I've got a pick here. And then, of course, all we have mm. to do, we've got a little salad here I'm dressing here, so a little tarragon vinaigrette. And, of course, you can put whatever you have, whatever beautiful fresh herb. That is amazing. You find that people, why do we just tend to stay away from the fresh herbs sometimes, just not... Well, you know, with the dried. yes, well, and you can use dried, but with the fresh ones, especially this time of year, they're popping out everywhere mm. at farmer's markets and our gardens. So it's so much fun take to advantage. use them. Yes. yes. So All right, good. I'm going to take this over here because we're walking. Okay. This is what I call kitchen sink pesto because mm. I get so many people asking questions. Okay, Nancy, I bought the herbs. What do now you want what? me to yeah. Right. <laughs> so this is a great way of using your herbs that you have left over. So I just have kind of like a a melange yes. of different herbs. I was going to say hodgepodge, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Nancy says it best. A melange. a melange. Okay, we're just going to put that in there. Oh, a clove wow. of garlic. Isn't that lovely? A oh, little lemon it smells, juice. It smells like summer. Like, I know. Like, like you're just envisioning having people over, having great meals outside. So wonderful. Okay, so now this is the secret. I don't use cheese in this, so this is actually vegan. This is tahini. And if you don't care if it's vegan, it's just delicious anyway. Right. So tahini is sesame seed paste. Mm -hmm. Bought it in the, gro you can buy it in the regular grocery store. Love it. Okay, lemon juice. And then whatever nuts you Ooh. have that are toasted, okay? Got it. Once I zhuzh this up, yes. we won't zhuzh because like, we're on TV. Yes, and it'll be loud. Yep. But I zhuzh, you get the idea. Yep. I forget it. And now I'm going to Look taste. at this. Okay. Oh my gosh, I can't wait for you to taste it. And oh, it's wow. whatever herbs you have left over. So you can use basil, you can use mint, you can use cilantro. That is dynamite. Mm -hmm. That is absolutely incredible. And you taste all of those flavors in your mouth all as, oh my gosh, comes mm -hmm. together beautifully. I mm. took too big of a bite. Okay, okay last but not least. Oh, I don't know this recipe, so tell me. You want me to talk for you? No. Mm. All right, shrimp. Coconut milk. Got it. Shrimp. Basil, mint, a little coconut sugar. Coconut La sugar? Mm hmm You can find it in the grocery store. A little bit better for you, a little less processed. Mm-hmm. Mm. Very good. That's really good. Garlic. Okay. What's good that doesn't I have know. garlic in it? I know. I love my garlic. Lime juice, fresh ginger. Um, green onions. Now, two things. A little fish sauce. Okay, you can find that in the grocery store too. Sure. Adds, this is kind of a Thai or Asian style dish. Yes. Adds that flavor. And then I use tamari today, but you can use any kind of light soy sauce that Got you it. want. Okay. And then you have, and all we did is just put the marinade on. So when you get finished with it, it, it looks, looks a like lot that. like 